Now, Lords have been doing tours here for a very long time, but this year you can actually do the Players Experience Tour, which includes at one o'clock lunch in the Players Dining Room. If I'm going to have the Players Experience, I'm going to dress like a player. I'm getting into my whites. This is a very typical match day menu, what we'd serve on a county match day or even a test match day here at Lords. In here we'll feed up to 70 players and their squads, uh, so about 30 to 35 in the squads, and then about 10 officials as well. The players get priorities, they come up and have their lunch first, and then the sort of uh, coaches and uh, physiotherapists and stuff like that, they come up afterwards. So we feed about 80 people in here on a match day, as you can see from quite a small kitchen uh, and quite a small room. So the players always get a soup, a vegetarian soup to start with. Prawns with Mario Rose sauce on the table, that's the little treat we give to the players on test match, that's what their favourite little snack to get started. Uh, for main course there's always a red meat, a white meat, a fish and a vegetarian dish. Then for dessert, uh, they'll have a choice of a warm dessert, a cold dessert, fruit salad and ice cream. Freddie Flintoff said he once bottled 75 overs in a test match here. Not because he was trying to take wickets, but because he was trying to burn off all the calories he uh, <laughs> ate over, over the time he was here. Well, after shoveling down three courses in 40 minutes, all I can wonder is how on earth do they go and play cricket after that? Because all I can do now is go into a food coma. The lunch was amazing. <laughs> you can't. It was, it was very, very good. How they could do it all in that short time is very impressive, I must say. It's good. It was good lunch. But it was great. Absolutely great. The food was absolutely spectacular. It was brilliant. I mean, I can't, I'm sad I'm not allowed to get a cricket because that's, yeah. I mean, I don't know how they do it going out after lunch because that was really good. So. How would you feel about eating that lunch and then going out and bowling 10 overs? I'd give it a go. <laughs> um, well, I think I should let it go down first. <laughs> I feel like roly poly. <laughs> No way. <laughs> Wouldn't be happening, I'd be asleep somewhere. <laughs>